Hey, hey, don't push my car. Okay, let's try to throw it, maybe. Yo, that was good. What's up everyone, I'm Azap in your video, we are back again with Mombazoo. Finally guys, we are back to my main save game because we got some stuff to finish. This is sucks. You know guys, we need to change all the rusty bolts in this car because I think most of them at the bottom. And also we're gonna install the new shocks for this car and it's the sports one that you can find at Caligas. Maybe this time we're gonna do some good drifts? Yeah, we will see together. Okay boys, let's take the pickup truck and head to Caligas. I hear a bus, I think. Oh yeah, that's the bus. What's up, my man? How you doing? Damn, yeah, the FPS dropped like... Almost dropped, I think, 20 FPS. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I got cold, you know, I'm sick a little bit. My nose like is leaking and sometimes like it's blocked. It's like not that good. Plus my throat like feels like shinso. And when I drink water, it doesn't feel so good. Like I really hate it. I hope I make it to the end of this video without sneezing and coughing on the mic. <laughs> You know, it's not good, man. Oh, wait, 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 wait a second. I had like an idea for the Mr. Bonjour thing because he doesn't want to answer us. Mr. Bonjour, I got a present for you. Oh, you really are disgusting. Yes, because now we talk, eh? Now we talk. Hey, hey, don't push my car. Okay, let's get the shocks, guys, and head back home. And as you can see, we got two shocks ready because you know like you can buy only two per day so we need four so yeah we got everything and let's head back home and i think maybe the next update gonna be the next month we don't know to be honest okay why he's slowing down too much okay overtake i did yeah scratch his car but sorry man and maybe in the next update we're gonna have like the project car and by the way it's not gonna be the bmw e30 i think like someone told me it's gonna be the car the picture in the racetrack apartment yeah that's the project car like i was like oh no i wanted like the e30 to be honest i want that car and that car on the picture i don't know it very good now we got the new shocks the sport one okay let me put them on the side of the bmw but the good question is can i remove the shocks without removing every part like i need to disassemble like five i think bolts yeah, let's see about that, and I hope it works. First of all, let me start with the front shocks. Okay, open the hood. Oh damn, like I almost forgot the jack stands, man. <laughs> let me put it on. And now we can get underneath the car. So we got, I believe, two bolts right here to remove. And one right here. Let's see if we can remove it. I hope it does. Oh yeah, we can remove it. Perfect. Now we can remove all the rally shocks. To be honest, like they look more like an off-road shocks. These ones. Okay. Why it doesn't work? Come on. I did remove like all the bolts. Oh yeah, that's how it works. I think I need to get it like on the side. Yeah, we will see about that if it works on this one. Yeah. Now guys, we did finish installing all the bolts for the new shocks, and now we need to see all the rusty bolts that we need to change and like these two and i think there is other two right here oh yeah they are rusty and i need to change them let's see which color we should use for this one maybe maybe blue yeah let's go for the blue before we start removing all the bolts i need to see how much bolts that we're gonna change so guys for the second step i'm gonna remove all the bolts so guys we completed the second step and now i'm gonna finish the third step we're gonna put the new bolts in so the first pack of the blue bolts they are done let me get the second one we dropped all the bolts in and let's tighten them up with the impact gun yeah before i die i need to get some maple syrup it's getting red and it's just doing some weird minecraft noises <coughs> and now the only thing left to do is changing the tires yep we're gonna get these damn now the garage is really messy i think gonna finish working tomorrow and i need to get some sleep oh yeah we had some really good sleep and i think i need to turn off the lights because it looks really weird so we already took off like the wheels so let me remove these spacers and try the new one maybe let's go 20 and let's see how it looks okay drop this in oh it looks good to be honest not bad for it 
So I put it like minus seven of camber and let's see how it looks with the 50, you know, spacers. Oh, it looks good. Maybe gonna put more. Okay, guys, it's the moment of truth. So let me remove these jack stands and let's see how it's gonna look like. So guys, we removed all the jack stands and it's very low and it needs some air. Damn, like the new shocks is low as hell. Maybe I'm gonna try 40 millimeters in the front and let's see how it looks. Now we can call it that's a good fitment. So we did use like 40 millimeter spacers and minus nine camber. Yeah, now it looks aggressive. Before we head to the city, you know guys, I had to take some poutine, coffee, maple syrup so we don't die and the most important thing the gas canister <coughs> oh no we didn't attach the manual transmission oh man even the exhaust performance bro what the hell is going on with me <laughs> shit yep now we should be good guys now we should be good yeah guys we spent many hours working this car and it's night right now i think i had to skip this day and wait for the third day oh yeah my racetrack apartment is a damn mess right now look at the parts and look at the food before we go we need to add some fuel to this car because it's like half tank oh yeah we're driving like crazy at the moment so we got like to do some testing for differential no 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 oh yeah almost these tires are very slidey as you can see Oh yeah, we need to stop real quick. Stop, stop, stop. Yeah, we're drifting already. So we're gonna drop some tire pressure on the rear. We're gonna put it like zero PSI. After that, we're gonna tune the issue real quick. Okay, press on this one and we're gonna drop the turbo pressure to zero and the traction control to zero. Oh yeah, she's like very slow. Oh yeah, we can do some big donuts. Yes, sir. So let's try to do some eights real quick. And right now let's drop the front tire pressure and let's see how it slides. Yeah, this, this view is not that good to be honest. Let's do like some freestyle drifting. Again. Yeah, that section is kind of weird. third gear is kind of a little bit long maybe if we add more tire i mean turbo pressure not tire pressure so it was like on one psi let's try four okay we're getting it that backfire man Ooh. second gear going around the trees change my mind going around maybe another tree right here going donuts maybe Try to change the view a little bit. So guys, we did install the differential LSD and let's see how it acts. Or maybe oh okay that was a really good one oh shit uh, yeah I did save it for a bit 
Oh yes, there is a bomb right here. Ooh. So we added more triple pressure and yeah, let's see. Ooh. Maybe let's try to get it on the street. Ooh. Okay, let's try to throw it maybe. Yo, that was good. So now guys, we did change the differential to lock it one and yeah, let's see how it acts. I think I'm gonna put it like 4 PSI. That's the best thing I think for this car. Oh, get it, get it. Ooh, that was, that was clear one. Hold it, good. Oh, first guys, let's try with the 1 PSI. I'm focusing like a lot right now. Handbrake. Let's try like third person. Oh no. Yeah, this is the worst. And breathe. Oh, damn. That was bad. <laughs> that was bad. You know what, I'm Barker right here. All upgrades with a lock differential, with a one turbo pressure and zero tire pressure. I think that's the best thing for drifting in Mombazu. That's it guys for today's episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure to smash that like button, share this with your friends, also comment and don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell button so you don't miss out anything. Thanks for watching, see you in the next video. Peace.